Right, back in our database, we are still working with our school database and I have added in an ID field and this is not an identity number, this is an auto number field. So this is just to show you how Microsoft Access can actually then keep track of all your records for you and give them a unique, um, what's the word I'm looking for, a unique field, something unique about each record, okay. But we're going to look at, according to my notes, default value. What does that mean default value? Well, let's see if I go to grade, for example, and I'm looking at my field properties for grade. If I go down my list, here's one that says default value and I can click over there. And let's say we're mostly taking in new grade eights. So we're going to be using this database for mostly grade eights. And then now that there might be a nine, a 10, 11 or 12. So I'm going to put an eight over there. That's a default value. So when I start a new record and let me show you, I'm going to switch to design view, go right down to the bottom so I can enter in a new record in my table. There it is there. And here's my new record. Okay. And if I scroll along till the end there, great it's already got a number eight filled in for me that's what a default value stands for here you can see I am on the ICT stationary fee field at the moment it is short text so if we look at that in our table it's right at the end it's numbers but I don't want numbers in a number format I want currency because this is money okay so switch back to design view ICT stationary fee I'm going to change my data type into currency there it is and here you can see I've got two things I've got format and I have decimal places format is currency if I look at any of the others I can choose currency euro fixed standard percent scientific I'm going to leave it at currency because that's what it is and decimal places I can choose auto now with currency it's going to be the best to leave it at auto because that's going to be two decimal places but you could specify if you wanted to zero decimal places one two three etc etc I'm gonna leave it at auto so that is my default settings there decimal places is auto format is currency